you can use whatever is your favorite doodle pattern. It's your doodle. You need to make yourself happy. This is the first time I'm doing this kind of painting slash doodle, so we're exploring this together. Now, the shape here looks like it's all the, together, but with me adopting different color scheme from here to here, you can see it's different. Sorry, I'm not talking very much because it's um, basically it's kind of difficult to have a conversation um, with you as I'm doing this. Okay, that's good. Now I want to have movement within the doodle patterns. So because when you have the varying pa patterns, um, it gives the eye a chance to travel on the dual and you can be as detailed as you want just have fun okay
kind of a modified hatching going on here to vary up the patterns. And a little bit of dot work here because it doesn't have a lot of real estate here but it's giving it a little pop okay so question of the day which shape do you like to doodle square triangle or circle let me know in the comments section below that would be great and if you want to get more videos hit the subscription button and you'll be notified when i do another video so this is the last one. Okay. So, this is a design element I want to include, because I like to include more than one example of something, like this, 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 and the, the plant-like leaves, and of course, it's triangles. I like. There's one more thing I want to do. Okay. The majority of the detail here was created by using my Thule art pen the zero two point but now i want to add some further details and i'm going to my, be using my uniball signal zero point two eight because it's really fine nip also i wanted to let you know that this part of the video was um, created um, with no sunlight so the only uh, form of light is from my um, light up here um, so it's, it's an ex experiment to see how the um, light goes because I'm up late in the evening and I want to see if I can still do videos for you now. So what I'd like to do is add a little bit more detail with this pen and I do that because it's kind of working with um, negative, negative space. Um, for example, um, before the um, 
paint was laid down for this it was white so um, basically negative space is anytime you have like say this part and this part is in the, the background more or less and you impact your space by adding different tones or values so this now becomes um, a darker value because of the lines on, I'm doing here as opposed to changing the negative and positive space um, with color or pigment. So th let me know um, if you can tell the difference between doing the video in the morning versus um, at night. Because I'm pretty okay either way. And since I'm up, I might as well do something other than watching Hulu or Netflix. Today is, was interesting in that I needed to do some shopping, but the elevator wasn't working. Um, but I did some shopping, but was able to use the surface elevator, which was good. Like my doodles and my colors I, I use, I sometimes have no idea what's going to come out of my mouth as far as talking goes. So it's kind of hit and miss with me. How your, was your day today? What did you, what did you get um, into? And this is doing, I, I'm doing this um, on December 27th. No, no, actually, um, December 29th. So how was your Christmas? Did you do anything? vessel other than uh, unwrapping your presents or eating. I use this pen because I like the fine nib. Um, I don't think um, any other nib that I've come across um, is as fine. But if you can um, let me know what pen you like to use, 
I'll check it out if I can. Basically, use whatever pen you have. I hope you're not getting seasick with me constantly moving my paper around. So if you're liking this video, if you can press the like button, that way YouTube will send that out to mo more people. And thank you. Okay. Give the circles a little bit of a dimension. So, the next video I'm going to suggest is um, kind of like this, um, but a little bit different. So, I hope you have enjoyed the video and got inspired to experiment with your doodles by adding watercolor and playing around with your pens. Have a good one, and have a great new year. Bye.